Hey guys, um, today is April 23rd, 2019. Uh, I'm gonna talk a little bit about Sasquatch or Stump Squatch. Oh man. Yeah, I thought I was uh, sitting here staring at a squatch probably about 75, 80 yards away. Uh, absolute black silhouette. Um, I could see what appeared to be part of the face, uh, both of the legs. And it was just standing there. And it's still standing there. And it'll probably be standing there tomorrow and next week and next month and next year. <laughs> there is a, uh, I haven't walked over to it, but uh, yeah, that's what you hear, rain, sprinkles, but uh, it's either a burned out tree or a black tree we'll call it a burned out tree um, and in between me and that is a stick or a branch sticking up from the ground which is given the illusion of legs Then it looks like, you know, I can see the full torso and the arms and the shoulders and the head and partial face. But it just so happens to be there is a pine bough, several of them in that area, and that's what's causing that effect. But boy, I tell you what, it sure does look real. Yeah, it's a little after 6 p.m., probably 6.20, and this was supposed to be done by 4 or 5 today. And I hope I'm not going to have a repeat of last, last August up there where I was just constantly in the rain. But uh, anyway, you know, back to uh, Sasquatch or Stump Squatch. Um, I have had three three daytime sightings and I got eight nighttime sightings now. And this really looks like a looks like a Sasquatch. I mean it really does. But would Sasquatch stand in the same spot? Out in the open? No. You know, so I've seen I've seen quite a few of these, you know, driving down the road. It's like, oh what's that? Oh, it's just a burned out stump. Or oh, what's that? Oh, it's just a shadow or you know. And I'm pretty sure that happens to just about everybody who goes out in the field or driving down the road trying to, you know, trying to spot one of these uh, forest people. And, you know, and, and I'm sure some people when they see it are absolutely convinced that, that they saw a Sasquatch. And, and, you know, the possibility that that's all it was that they saw. Uh, not taking anything away from people who have sightings because I'm, you know, I'm one of those people. Um, but I've also been fooled by the stump squatch. So, um, it's just an interesting thought I was, I was having about it was, uh, you know, how many people actually, <laughs> see real live stump squatches you know versus how many people have seen real live sasquatch 
You know, I figure if there's, you know, tens of thousands of Bigfoot sightings, there's got to be a hundred thousand people that's just driven down the road and went, oh, wow, what's that? And never said another thing about it. I don't know. Um, God, that sure looks real. <laughs> that sure looks real. I don't know. I, I wouldn't be able to get zoomed in on it. Hmm. No. <clears throat> yeah, without me being able to, uh, it, it's back over that direction. That definitely just proved that it's not a Sasquatch. Because they don't stand still to let themselves be filmed. Well, I'm uh, I'm all dressed up and and ready for the night and uh, see what happens. Last night wasn't real busy. Uh, there was, you know, I had uh, a couple of good knocks and I've had several today. I even had a uh, little dog barking, no little dogs out here. Um, but yeah, a couple of knocks last night. Uh, Might have heard a whoop, I'm not for sure on that. And I'm really baffled right now because my phone is saying I'm, I've got text messages in an area I don't, wow. Another one. I must have service right now. Huh. I never get any service out here. So I just got three 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 or four texts that just came in. So I don't know. Maybe I'll try and call mama. Yeah, we're going to try and call Mama, see if I got service. Peace out, guys.